Let's play this really quick. Wait, not hold on one second. Um, let's see if there's any news on this missing. Yeah, we have to talk about that. So let's get started. We did uh try to film a Kevin Hart um uh, about the whole Kevin Hart controversy yeah. of not ho hosting. We did film it, but yeah, the news changed. But news changed fast, really so, quick. Yeah. So now they're saying um there might not be a host this year, and like since uh what eighty nine eighty nine yeah. So that should be interesting. Um, so what what will happen? That's the thing, like. How could you make it? How, how right. did they make it fun? So first, let's start off with this. I believe Ellen had interviewed Kevin. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. so, so how do you guys feel about all what Kevin said on Ellen show? By the way, be kind to one another. Thank you. And when I watched the episode, I, I told Danny that I thought he was host. So this is kind of like surprising to me that he decided. To I had a feeling he wasn't. I I had a feeling that he did get pretty offended by the situation because um I thought he was great on Ellen. He was very honest. Um, but you could tell that this really struck a chord in him. Mm -hmm. Um, I think like you said, he tried the last 10 years to really show who he really is. Yeah. And I think his body of work has proven that. Um, do you, think, do you think though, it's just for this, this time or like, probably he's just fed up? I think he's just, I think he's- Do you think he has a chance of coming back? I think he's, a, he's too him. emotional about it for him to do it this year. I don't see it happening. But it can happen, though. It could happen eventually. So you're not ruling it out completely. You're just saying there's chances are. I think it's really... I think they're out of the window for this year. But following in the future, I feel like... He He'll would. do it, right? Yeah. Because who wouldn't love Kevin? They might have a, a, a separate conversation like after this is over. Just Kevin and the, the yeah. people that run the academy. And just... So he... So he could come back and maybe they have everything laid everything out on the table and so there's not um but any hostility or anything. But for me I feel like this, I don't know why. I feel like it's gonna be really distracting not to have a host. I don't know what could they, they could do. just get anybody. I don't they know. Are they gonna play like a, a slideshow? I know like they're saying that they're gonna just basically like have people in groups and then I think it's gonna be groups. something that is not gonna work. What do you mean groups? Like, you know, they're going to do, like, you know, dancing numbers, and it's going to be, like, kind of, like, the people that talk about the nominations and all that. But, I mean, every... All award shows have hosts. I know, exactly. Like, find it's, somebody. It's the Academy Awards. Like, yeah. Like, I've seen here Michael Shanahan was do you put think, out there. Do you think they, they might not have the time, maybe? To um, rehearse or anything? Supposedly, maybe that's one factor? Supposedly, Michael Shanahan that's from... Good uh, that's a good point, right? Yeah. From Good Morning America. No. I guess... He, I mean, he would have been fine, but he said something that I want to make sure I could give it all my all and make sure the production is a great representation of me and my talent. I can't do that right now. So, unfortunately, I can't do it this year. So, I think exactly that people are worried they might not have enough time to rehearse, no, but yeah. I don't think that's an issue. Only two weeks. And they, they do have rehearse. some guy that I think we all know well who I think can kill it. Jimmy Kimmel. Yeah, Why not call him back, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not call him back, right? Yeah, He's there in the last, me. what, two years now? Jimmy Kimmel. Yeah, yeah. Anybody, man. Come anybody. on, just hand him the script for... The only difference for him is it's just 2019. That would be yeah. the only difference. Why not call him back Kimmel? Yeah, no, this is really awkward. This is going to be awkward. No, we just know with Kimmel. Yeah. It's going to be hella awkward. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. But man. I mean, like, you'd rather have a host as Kimmel doing how great he is or have someone else or have nobody. Like yeah yeah I sure. feel like the alternative of having nobody stupid is this it's gonna be awkward it's gonna be weird so is it is it confirmed? Um, I mean Vanity Fair is a pretty solid source in the industry. They so they said it looks like or like it's just bro this is like this is very it's very petty I don't know like this is kind of childish by I don't know they have to because this out. is not the first time I heard it like I you know um scrolling through my phone I. I I passed by it, but it wasn't really like it was just like a rumor. It was just like a thought. Like there, what if there's no holes, or maybe there's no holes? But I yeah, it says be. Oscar producers are apparently planning to leave the spot empty and instead focus on clusters of top tier talent to introduce different segments. Individuals with knowledge of the plan told the trade outlet. Hmm. That's just weird. Well, yeah, this is awkward. I also see where it says, like, uh, <clears throat> the show will, is, according to Vanity Fair, it says, um, the show will remain hostless un unless a massive star, think Hugh Jackman or Dwayne Johnson, suddenly pops up 
tackles the gig. Yeah. Hugh Jackman. <laughs> Dwayne Johnson would be Yeah, dope. he would be dope. The Rock, the Rock would be yeah, yeah, yeah. But this man making, like, he's popping out movies, like, left and right, so he's probably busy. Yeah, so, I, I don't know. This, this is crazy. They said they're, they're here that this year's batch, they're basically going to focus on what, what a great year has been for music and film. You know, like, talking about Lady Gaga, Kendrick Lamar, and Dolly Parton. Oh, yeah. Why? I, I like, this is not Wild the Grammys. Like, you know what I mean? This is not the Grammys. It's not the Grammys. This is freaking the Oscars. Movies. The creme of the creme of film. What is this? I don't know, bro. I don't know. Yeah. But okay. I, mean, I don't think Jenny Kimmel... He, he would be great. Yeah, why not? I yeah. think Jenny Kimmel or The Rock. The Rock would be amazing. Dwayne Johnson. I yeah. feel like... I wouldn't mind having Ellen back, but I don't know she... I love Ellen. I, I she wouldn't do it only out of respect for Kevin. At least not Yeah, But, okay, so also the Oscars have been, like, dealing with, you know, their ratings going down. This is going to lower the hell out of it. It's going to make it worse. No, I, I disagree. I disagree. You think it's going to bring the ratings yeah. up? Just for this one time, yeah. Just the first fact time, that they don't have a host? First time ever. Yeah, people are tuning in to be like, how's people, people want to see how it's going to go. I mean, it happened in 1989. People, people love to see failure. And just with ABC being just a programming it is, like, you know, they'll figure it out. We're going to go up, bro. ABC will figure it out. I'm, I'm watching. Like, how the hell are they going to pull this off? No, no I'm going to watch. I was going to watch anyway. I'm going to watch because I want to watch, not yeah. because of that. I don't care. But now I'm just more, I'm more curious. How, they, how the hell are they going to pull this off without a host? Let me host. Let's <laughs> <laughs> stay a film. Give us a film. Let me go. Okay, so yeah, that's our take on the Oscar saga. Yeah. Let's see. Is there gonna be hosts? small group of people being very, very loud. We are a huge group of people who love you and want to see you host the Oscars.